you, you have to get ready to go. Did you put deodorant on? Did you wash your face? Did you take your medicine? Uh-huh. These are my braces, and I also walk with um, crutches. Although I wish I could live without both of them. Aaron has spina bifida. He was diagnosed when he was in utero. The transport team from Children's came to get him when he was a couple hours old. I like to move it, move it. You like to move we didn't really know, will he walk or will he have problems with his brain function? That's me walking, skiing. Aaron, are you okay? <laughs> Not knowing where he was on that spectrum is very difficult. I like to know if I can do a couple things and I'll never know unless I try. We're going water skiing and kayaking. It's been difficult to make friends, but I think these next couple years are going to be the hardest because junior high is hard in and of itself. It's going to be interesting. One of the big benefits of children's, we knew that this was a children-centric hospital. Have you had to be in the hospital a lot? Oh, yes. I like come out always healthier and stronger and a better man. They understood the needs of the child, they understood the needs of the parents. As many of us go there with many needs of our own, they really do care for the whole family. Okay. I think the key for him is continuing with his positive attitude, pushing forward, meeting new challenges. I made the move of all moves. I bought her a bracelet and a necklace, and she's wearing it. Before Aaron was born, we didn't even know if he would be able to walk. You know, after all this time, I can't believe that I'm actually telling him to slow down. It's amazing. We're just, you know, happy to have chosen children's.